This was New Year's Eve, 1987, okay? I was up on 119th in Figueroa with the West Side Denver Lanes. And um, there's a, apartments, a lot of apartments on both sides of the streets, okay? <laughs> so what we, was, what we were trying to do was shoot the street lights out so it could be real dark from 119th Street all the way to 117th Street. We wanted pitch black. There's a whole bunch of apartments right there. We wanted to be, you know, we wild. I'm 17 years old, right? So I got a six shot, six shot, 12 gauge Mossberg. So when, you know, it's, it's a, lot, a lot of traffic on Figueroa. Not a lot, but it's traffic on Figueroa. So I don't shoot. So I wait for the traffic to clear up. I take the gun. Boom! I try to shoot out the street light. I missed it didn't, it didn't go out. So I'm like, damn. So I, I wait for I waited again. I put the gun behind my back, the six shot twelve gauge behind my back. I come back out again. Boom! I missed again. I'm like, damn. I'm sorry, shot. What is what's going on, man? So I put the gauge behind my back, right? Both hands. Man, while I was standing in front of the apartments on Figueroa. The police rolled up one time, real slow, cruising. So I'm like, damn, did they, I know they heard the shots. Did they, you know what I'm saying? Like, do they know it was me? So I'm standing like this with my hands behind my back, and I got the gun, you know, going straight down along with my, you know, my legs, the back of my legs, right? So they can't really see it. But they see they see I'm holding something behind my back. So they stop. They just looking. And I'm looking at them, right? Boom. So one of the homeboys, he was upstairs in apartments watching the whole thing. And he called me, he said, man, they about to jack you. He said, they about to jack you, you better run. I said, I got, he said, he said, just run. I get the thing. He said, toss the, you know, toss the gun over there and I'm going to, you know, I'm going to get it, right? So boom, because if the police, if I run in apartments, the police got to drive around Figueroa. They got to drive down 118th and go to the alley to try to catch him, right? I mean, unless they just jump out the car right there on Figueroa, but... It's too much traffic right there. So, boom. I turn around, I take off. And I throw the gun, boom, by the bushes, boom. And fall, I hear it fall down. I'm running, I'm running. I hear the police. They go 118. Uh, boom. So I'm running, hopping gates, going through here, hopping gates. And I hear them, you know. They run, they chase it, they try to chase it, but they don't know they 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 running through the alleys trying to figure out where I'm at. So my dumb ass, I run from somebody's backyard because it was you know, with the alley go like this, and then there's people homes, houses right there, and then there's the apartment building. So I first I hop somebody's gate in their backyard <laughs> and then I get nervous and jump out of the yard and run to the apartment building and jump in some bushes. <sighs> now keep in mind. I'm, I'm not flamed up, but I got some red feelers on. And my dumb ass, my foot is sticking out the bush, but, you know, and the rest of my body is is considered they can't see me. So I hear the... <laughs> so I'm like, damn, I'm, my heart beating. I'm about to fart. I'm scared to death, right? So I don't hear nothing for a while. I think they turn their radio down. <laughs> right? So boom. All of a sudden, I feel somebody grab my ankle. They snatched out the bushes. Here you go, you fucking asshole, right? Oh, they, you know, they, they sock me up. They beat me up. Right? Punch on me a couple times, right? Put my they knee in my back. Cuff me up. Boom. So they was like, they was like, where's the, where, where's the gun, asshole? Where's the gun at? You threw the gun, asshole. Where's that? I was like, gun? That wasn't no motherfucking gun. They was like, what was it? I said, man, that was a police baton. I, I threw it because I didn't know I ain't supposed to have no police baton. They was like, get the fuck out of here, you asshole. Where's that fucking gun at, you fucking prick? So I was like... I ain't got no gun. So in my mind, I'm thinking the homie, he, I know he grabbed it because, you know, back then, that's how motherfuckers looked out for each other. I thought he go grab it and take it in the house, you know, and they ain't got no case, you know what I'm saying? So, boom, they take me to jail on a dry run. So they got me right there on the ground. One dude, like, did you find it? So they're doing that, they're walking around, and the fool don't find it, right? But they they waiting for they they searching for about a good, 30 minutes, it seemed like. You know what I'm saying? But I'm on the ground. They searching. They looking for it. They knew I had something. But thank God, my homeboy, he grabbed the, the pistol. He grabbed the gauge. 
and took it in the house. Boom, just stayed in the house, right? So boom. So they pissed. So they punched him a couple times. Oof, oof, oof. It was like, oh yeah, it's New Year's Eve. We're gonna take you to the Jordan Downs. Yeah, I was like, what? Jordan Downs? I'm like, damn, they're gonna take me way over there. You know what I'm saying? They're, they're, you know, this this is the LAPD. They're a gang too. They known for doing that type of shit. This is this is the area where you know what I'm saying the police just drop you off in your enemy hood, like you know what I'm saying, like it ain't nothing, right? So boom. So I'm like, damn. So he's like, put this ass on the car. So now I know that I ain't going to jail for no guns. So I ain't tripping off nothing else, right? Unless they put something on me. Unless they go put a gun, some dope on me, I'm through. But they put me in the car, boom. So we rolling down uh, Imperial, roll up Imperial. We bust a right, I mean, excuse me. We, I roll up Figueroa and I bust a right on Imperial. Right, I think they take you back to the police station. This is Southeast Division. The police station is on 108th and Main, right? So boom, we go over there and let them do this Broadway hood, right? Boom, they 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 turn on, uh, we turn off Imperial on, onto Broadway, right? They they roll, woo, woo, then they slow down. It's a gang of Broadways. Well, they probably weren't a gang. Probably about ten, but that's a gang of people, right? So with the way the police pulled up. Woo, they kind of like a couple of them broke. They must have been strapped. It's, it's New Year's Eve, right? They run. So they boom. They was like, hey, hey, like, hey, we got one in the car. Like, tell me we got, we got some uh, enemy in the car. Hey, we got one in the car. And somebody was like, so what? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, my, we, like so what? You know what I'm saying? Boom. So they were like, oh, okay. You know, because they ain't biting, right? They said, let's take them over there in Front Street, Watts Hood. I was like, oh my God, no, they taking me further and further away from my area. You know what I'm saying? Like, if they let me off in Lem Deuce Hood, I probably had, a, you know, I don't know if I had a chance, but I was closer. You know what I'm saying? They taking me to Front Street, Watts Hood. That's 106th, 108th, Central, all that, Wadsworth, all down over there, right? So I'm like, damn. Sure enough, we go to the hood. We drive through the hood, miraculously, nobody is out. Boom, right? They go down 100, I think the 106, 105, 106. We go down the street, they going real slow. They looking for somebody, ain't nobody out, right? If they is out, they they hiding, right? But this is the era, it's 1987, so people used to be outside selling cocaine, selling crack. So, but, but miraculously, nobody's out. I was like, damn, right? So I said, damn, if nobody's out over here, what are you gonna take me next, right? So boom, they was like, let this asshole out, you know what I'm saying? He, he, let's see if he make it back to his hood, right? This is far enough, right? This is the police said, right? So they whoop, they take me out on 108th. Now, 108th and Central is a 10 8 Bounty Hunters, and then you got some Circle City Pyroos over there. But I'm more on the, on the, on the Crip side, the Front Street Watch side. I'm still on they, I'm still on their side, right? So I'm like, damn, so my mind, like, damn, should I chance it and go back the other way and, and try to go to the hood? Or should I run? You know what I'm saying to Central, right, and try to get to uh, Bounty Hunter Hood because I knew a few niggas from 10A, a few homies over there. You know, give me a ride back to the hood, right? So I'm like, damn, but it's a nice little. I'm I'm at a little, little distance, right? You know, this, this is 87. Motherfuckers be rolling down the street, cars, bikes, they patrolling the hood. I'm thinking, you know, what I'm saying somebody see me over there, they think I'm from Bounty Hunter and pop me. You know what I'm saying? So boom, uh, police uncuff me. Get out of here, asshole. I take off running. So I run. <laughs> I said, fuck that. I ran to uh 10 8 Bounty Hunter Hood, right? I'm running. I get down there. I'm tired. Boom. So when I get down there, I go down to name. It's a little spot. Me and my homeboy Zell used to go over there. There's a few Bounty Hunters. He, you know, gambling. They was over there gambling. So I knew where they be at, right? So And I knew a couple of them from Centennial, right? I went down there. Boom. Ran down there. And I seen some. I said, blah, blah, blah. They was like, who that? I said, blah, Creek Creek from Mantis, right? From Mantis Park, right? I said, man, one time just dropped me off over there in Front Street, Watson. They was like, what? I said, yeah, man. They was, one of them was like, you need to ride back to your hood? I was like, yeah, homie, please. He said, all right, boom. So they had the bro ham, boom, jumped on the broom, boom, boom, boom. We, 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 we rolled up Central, and they dropped it back off in the hood, right? It's 1987. So this is the kind of games the police used to be playing back in the day. So you got to realize, you know, they a gang too, you know what I'm saying? So I, I didn't go to jail because they, they didn't get the gun, but they knew I had something. So my me, by them not getting nothing, they was doing return the favor by dropping me off in the enemy hood. If I didn't went the other way and tried to go back the way I, that they, I came, I probably would have been through with money. So that was my best option and I made it. 
just another day in South Central LA, man. You know what I'm saying? If you like the story, hit subscribe. Peace.